If you've ever seen a Mormon temple, you probably noticed it doesn't look like other buildings. That's on purpose. So what makes it different? Well, let's go back to biblical times. From the very beginning, God's people have built temples. Moses had his tabernacle, a sort of traveling temple. Then Solomon built a temple, one of his greatest accomplishments. During his life, Jesus Christ spent a lot of time in the temple at Jerusalem, helping, healing, and teaching. And basically, that's still what happens in temples today. Here, let me show you. A temple is different from other church buildings. Inside the different rooms, people make promises with God. Promises to keep His commandments, promises to be good husbands and wives, promises to share what we have to help take care of each other. Because Mormons believe families are eternal, temple marriages are performed to last forever, so families can always be together. And that includes our ancestors, too. So who can go inside a temple? Well, at first, everyone. When a new temple is built, there's an open house for the public. Afterwards, it's only open to members of the church who have prepared themselves to make sacred promises with God. The truth is, temples aren't special because they look pretty from the outside. Instead, it's about what happens in the hearts of the people inside, because that's where God does His most important work.